Hey everyone, welcome to the final mission of the StarCraft 1 campaign. We have three more after this, but... All I have left is to see this through. The Zerg have taken everything from me. My home, my family, my friends. I know that nothing I do can bring those things back. But I'll be damned if I just sit on my hands and wait for the end. I want a piece of them, all right. I'm in. Then let our actions speak for us. For Adun. For Ayr. I just like how he has his tongue sticking out. Just like, yeah, we're gonna fight the Ormite, and then Jimmy's just like, <laughs> Alright. Executor, Tassadar, this comes too late to you. But the Conclave has witnessed your defeat of the Cerebrate. They know now that they cannot deny the necessity or the valiancy of your actions. We sought to punish you while it was we who were in error. You represent what is greatest in us all, and all our hopes go with you. Pentaro Adun, brave sons of Ayr. Wow. Does that mean they're going to send some backup for us? Outstanding. So, this is where it's like, oh, you might think that this is a, uh, uh, this is a Protoss mission. No. Secretly, this is a Terran mission because I guess we have Protoss units. We're not going to use them. It's going to it's going to be all about these guys. And you might be saying like, "Well, why is that, man? Like, don't you like Protoss?" Sure, they're fine. I just like Terran more. I don't even care, man. I just would rather play as the Terrans. Terrans are Terrans are love. Terrans are life. So here's what we're going to do. Just to appease the masses. This is basically a Terran mission, but we're gonna be having Archons. We're gonna see how far we can get the Archons because I don't know what else you can um, spend our gas on. And I wanna do like the longest, grindiest mission out there. This is where someone's gonna be like, alright, I'm out, please leave the video. I wanna, because I always like cut this way and then like expand, whatever. I wanna know like what happens when we cut this way and expand. You know, like, I just, like, I just want to have fun. Like, and this is my favorite mission in StarCraft 1. Oh, and we can actually use, uh, Jimmy J. Rayner. Because we could repair him. Isn't that sick? Alright, so, we will want to get gas eventually. For now, what we should do is, like, focus on defenses. And if we can somehow get to um, if we can unite our forces somehow, that would be great. Um, but I feel like that's gonna be easier said than done. So in the meantime, what we're gonna do is we get another barracks. We start getting marines. We get marines, siege tanks. Uh, oh, look at that. We could definitely take this area if we really wanted to. Alright, let's see. Okay, okay. Um, that'll be a gas base. And actually, can we build another command center? Because I think there's like minerals down south. We want to get as many freaking minerals as we can. 
get our marine friends in high population. We don't have Timurals. Okay, okay, we'll work towards that. Give me a lot of bunkers, a lot of um, a lot of everything. I'm excited. Planning for the long haul. Oh, we're blue too. Okay, that's nice. That's nice. Uh, we should try and get him more interceptors, but really, we're focusing too much on the economy right now. It's really, really give a flying fig. Though right now, we can definitely afford to have some Archons. But we need, we need upgrades. Upgrades, upgrades, upgrades. Um, Alright. Okay. So what we need is gateway. Because we need to get more minerals somehow. Oh, there's so much things to spend our money on. Oh, this is exciting. See, I love these missions because like you slow ramp up, but there's so much room to grow. Like I like this because this is like the ultimate macro map. We get to get like a huge army. Just go whatever, take names, um, blow up chumps and all things like that. But it's like it's gonna take us some time to get there, but that's okay. Like that's part of the fun. Get like a ridiculous amount of units, like and this isn't gonna be a hard mission. Like not at all. And we should actually get Hold on, where is is there a ledge over here? I believe there is. Like a ramp. Because if we can just hold the ramp, that'd be much easier. Okay. Maybe not. Maybe not. Alright, so in the meantime, now we're actually pulling a lot of minerals. So we can start working towards. Uh, upgrades. We'll get the academy, and we need to get some. Start getting some siege tanks as well. We have these. We can throw down a nexus, but we also need to get um, a gateway. So we can start getting archons, because archons are what we're going to spend our gas on, 100%. And you can get a couple more interceptors, because I care. Um, and let us build a bunker here. Just protect our investments. Okay. And we're gonna need more supply depots, so... Why stop? And I am very curious to see what's up this ramp, so... So let me see, well, to get Archons, we need the Cyber Dex Core, we need Citadel of a Dune, and then we need to have Archon. That's gonna be... That's gonna take a while, but... We'll get there. Machine shop. Uh, we're gonna want some armories too, but we're just gonna quickly like, rocket jump to science facility because we want to get the upgrades. Because if we're gonna be in for the long haul, we want to get the upgrades as quickly as possible so that with the upgrades we can get, um, or, um, golly, what am I just trying to say? Complete. So, okay, you always want the upgrades because they're just going to be useful. And then, well, actually, I don't know if we should be focusing too much on the bio. I think we want to go mech, especially against Zerg. Yeah. So maybe not. Though we could get bunkers. So I'm, like, figuring this all out on the fly. Upgrade complete. Um, Upgrade complete. Just, like, so much oh no! Someone got parasited. That's not good, and we have a lot of money all of a sudden. 
I guess we should start going for um Protoss upgrades. Oh, do we not put guys in the gas? That's embarrassing. Uh, tanks, siege mode, science facility. Let's go. That upgrade is complete. Um, continue with the supply depots, and then we get armories. They gave us a lot of space to build here. That's awesome. And a lot of minerals. I'm very thankful for that. Um, good, good. First tank. Yeah, actually, let's throw that here. Okay, the science facility, then we can get certain more upgrades. The Marines, I think, are going to start laying off of. Or is, so we're gonna need more factories, but I think I want to take like another base from the commit to factory production. I may as well get the physics lab. Wah! God, I mean, we're getting marine upgrades. Or infantry upgrades. Then maybe it would be smart to um, get them. And we're slowly working towards Templars. That'll happen eventually. Most of our attention so far is focused on the Terran here. Yeah, I guess we're gonna want spider mines and all these other great things. Oh, we don't actually have three dance here, I don't think. Okay, so Oops. This is why you don't put the tanks in front of the bunkers. That's a mistake. Okay. I really do wish we had medics. If we had medics, oh ho ho. Uh, build a turret. Upgrade complete. Upgrade complete. Uh, we could get armor. You could get Zell legs, but I'm not sure if we really want that. Wait, where are you upgrading? Oh, okay. Oh, we don't. We need Templar archives. Right, right, right. Um. I will say, it sounds a little bit off the voice of the Marines with the uh, Frost music. Oh, right. Oh, our mech upgrades are completely forgot. Weapons. Plating. Actually, I almost think too we should get the chip plane as well. I get all the upgrades because we're having. We have a lot of money. So may as well spend it. Get some Valkyries. Oh, ah, he needs to get repaired. And we'll place a bunker here. We have a lot of Marines. I think another bunker here would be appropriate. Complete. Um, we do need to scout out more bases. Which actually, what we can do is get vultures for that. How ingenious! <laughs> Boy, I'm gonna pull myself. And we'll build one more. All right, perfect. So, if you're gonna be maxed out, start getting the ship play. Man, we have so many upgrades. Plasma shields, good, good. And now, oh, well, look at that. Now we're actually out of um, gas. Probably because he we went so hard on the upgrades. Isn't that funny? Well, okay then. Let's just build a gateway here. 
And gateway here. So, yeah, I guess we'll start getting some zealots then. Actually, and we should probably get a uh, couple oh, dragoons. Just so we're not completely screwed. Okay, so far they haven't really been taking um, our uh, cross friends much, which is good. Oh, we got a power cruiser. Good. You know what you're saying? Like, isn't that weird that, like, you're talking about, like, oh, we got a power cruiser. It's like, well, what happens sometimes, like, I place the order for the unit, and then I just forget about it. Also, zealots aren't fun to scout with, they're not fast. This is kind of why we need to get um, we need to get uh, what she calls it, Goliath. Uh, okay, vehicle plating, good. All right, you seem much faster now. Good. Uh oh, we're out of minerals. All right. We need to expand. There's gotta be a nexus location here somewhere. It's definitely not there, okay. Fair enough. Expansion location. Um, let us get some Templars. Is that Fossil Shields level 3? I think so. Alright, good. We made it to the promised land, so we're gonna get a nexus, so that's good. That solves one problem for us. Getting a, um, another base secured. Get some pylons. Get another battle cruiser. Anytime you're ready. Alright, and in the meantime, reach you, sir. let's see if we can. Yeah, okay, here we go. This is what we wanted. No oh, is that it? Uh, and let's place some mines I'm down there. See, and here's the sad part I get so excited about taking the bases, like, I'm. Like, this is, like, the gameplay loop of me just, like, spending my money, getting more bases. Like, that's the fun part for me. And I get so involved in that, and then it's like, oh, it's going to be over before you know it. Um, and then we should probably... Um, I'm trying to think, how do we want to do this? Well, let's transfer all the probes, at least. Um. Upgrade complete. Upgrade complete. Yes, executor. Oh, yes. Positive shield level three. That's good. 
And we're starting to get Archons. Um, Archons online, thank you. Goliath. Oh dear. Run away! That's another base down there. What's this way? Oh, hold on. Oh, that's another base. I want to take that base for sure. All right, good. Oh my goodness, we have to get everything. Tanks, plating, or uh, weapons, plating, ship weapons. Yes, sir. Not Job I think we have more money uh, than we can spend soon enough. Oh, it's nice that you guys got boots to play. Alright, well, this is over here. Yeah, I'm going. Oh, is that it? I dig. This is very fascinating for me because I've never been to. Alright, just some hydralisks. Is that it? Yeah, I'm going. There's a lot of bases to take. I dig. Like a ton. Like more than we could possibly ever need. It's a little disappointing because in some ways there's almost like no less than I thought there was going to be. I dig. Yeah, because they're all just like clustered no around the problem. center. Yeah, I'm going. Go ahead, turn off. Can I read you? Yes, sir. Order okay, proceed. well. Reporting for duty. Not permanent. Oh, we should get. Uh, yeah, we don't need this, this many Templars. We should start getting, um, air weapons, ground armor, add on complete, more tanks, and then we need to figure out how to... Oh, okay. Yes, sir! We're gonna go ahead and relocate some troops so we can start protecting our investments. Um, yeah, I think we're going to do Zelda Archon. Here. I'm just going to this sell it. Oh, micro. All right. Oh dear. Get out of there! Ah! Oh boy, okay, well they really just punched through that, didn't they? Uh, we lost everything! No! What happened here? I feel like they need to die now. Can we get this vulture all the way to our pro -us friends? Is that gonna be possible? He's gonna do it. Oh, look at that. Hello, is this more resources? It absolutely is. All right, cool. Hello, enjoy this vulture. Dear Protoss. Um, oh, okay. I hit the point where I'm, now I'm actually like overwhelmed because we have so many things going on. We have so many minerals too. Oh my goodness. We can get more production. Get more zealots. So we can just like start bombing the enemy. Uh... 
plating. Okay. Oof. Um, oops, no, we don't want that. Battle cruisers. Go. Right, that should be sufficient for you guys for now. I'll actually relocate a couple more Goliaths. No! Leave the dudes alone! Ah. Mom, the Protoss are attacking, or the Zerg are attacking. Dude, I would love to get a pro over to you. I probe somewhere to the Terran base. Alright, we've been very uh, passive, so what we should do is try and take this location. Um, and in the meantime, Did we lose a Templar? That would be really important for us, I guess. Okay, we'll take this base too. <laughs> That's it, I'm just, I'm only interested in expanding. Get some Dragoons so we have some more defenses. Oh my goodness, those dudes are so obnoxious. Okay, we need to wait for more minerals. In the meantime, we can get more um, Templar. I feel like we should be able to attack. Um, the Zerg base now. That's not quite enough defense, right? I think so. Oh, we need more supply depots. Oh, baby. Alright, good. I'm glad he made it. We have our Terrans. Securing this location. Cool, all right. Yes, sir. Let's build another command center. I don't like how quiet it is. We need more pylons. All right, we can we can accommodate that. All right, we need to free up some supplies. What we're going to do is we're going to attack. Finally. We're finally at the time in our lives where we just want to attack. And we have all of these pro upgrades, right? Yes, I think so. Alright, I'm hoping you by like attacking them, we can just, like thin their ranks. And while that's going, we're going to go um, see what the eye can see. Oh, welcome to. Oh, this L should be able to fight both of them, I think. Look at that. That Zell just took on two hydras, is no problem. All right, we found our mineral base. Perfect. Uh, but we need more Templars. All right, well, that first attack didn't seem like it did that well. That's okay. I'm fine to have some attacks that are doomed to fail. Uh, meanwhile, what's happening? Okay, we're almost out of minerals. Orders received. So, our, it's appropriate that we're expanding now. We need more Terran units. Um, 
tanks and the like. And actually, this command center means nothing to us now. So, actually, I wonder if we can relocate itself. That might be fun. Let's see about taking this base. Holy! Ah! Oh, what part of siege mode don't you guys understand? Wow, they sent a huge attack. Um, that's not great. That's fine. Uh, do we have any other? Receiving transmission. Oh, we should think that they really a lot of um I'll just listen to us. Receiving Good. Send a contingent of Archons to protect our investment. And I do want to entertain the idea. Oh my goodness, we have a lot. Entertain the idea of attacking some more. Um, shoot, I can't believe we've lost all of the CVs. That sucks. Luckily, we have this base. You guys seem like you're doing alright. Uh, and we can actually probably get more zealots. Do we need this many? Here right now. I mean, we're gonna be repopulating re this area anyways, right? So, let's attack for now. Oh, more expensive than we Shake a stick at. This is good. Uh, yes, all of our SCVC elsewhere. Where is Jimmy J. Rainer? Here he is. I'm just gonna hide him here so that he doesn't um, get toasted. Here's the ramp house thing. Yeah, we put this on lockdown. We're gonna be using it. And we'll have like our, um, our scouting. Man, they're really fighting hard, aren't they? Merge, you fools! Uh, you don't need to be down here. No sorry, Tim. And actually, we have money for vultures! Boy, I feel like some SCVs would be, wouldn't be bad, would they? Oh, 
But I mean, that's a good way to prove the piece of Drop me. I mean, I guess now we're just gonna hang down here. Ah! Everything's falling apart. Luckily, Archons are strong. We're getting more tanks for this. And we have some E shields. Good. You guys can throw down your Spire Mines if you want to. I'm okay with that. We're getting more tanks, um, which we're building. And I would actually wouldn't mind another Valkyrie. Oh, we need more supply units. Okay, we will work on that. Okay, in the meantime, you guys just can heal here. Um, how are we doing? Oh boy. Um. Okay, we can march you guys forward. Um, if we could reunite or unite the Frost and the Terran, that'd be great. So that's actually okay. Your guys' objective is trying to get to these guys. Whether or not that's gonna work, you know, remains to be seen. More pylons. All right, all right. Where did the archons go? Oh, sure. Here, you guys can be part of the fun too. The arm, our macro really slipped. Okay. Can our Archons even make it to us? Where is the tank here? Uh, I feel like we're getting close. So there's the Overmind. I don't really want to kill him yet. I mean, I think we could, though, like... And see, and this is the thing, I'm thinking, I just felt like I was getting into the crew things. Um, and it's like, oh, it's over, by the way. He's right there. He's angry, too. That's what I get for just, like, A-moving. Like, look at that. I was like, yeah, we're finally reaching max potential, guys. And then it's just like, oh, by the way. You're gonna end up just crushing me. Like, okay, that's cool, I guess. I didn't really want to, like... Keep playing this for that much longer. And this, yeah. Anyways, well. Where are Goliaths at? Okay, yeah, well. I mean, we succeeded, they met up. I just, you know. We just killed them, though. That's okay. That's fine. I'm not disappointed or anything, no. Oh, and there's one Zealot. Yay! Okay, well, I feel like that was a bit of an INT by magic finish.
Great. We are victorious. Um, cool. Yeah, um... We did it. As the chaotic swirling energy subsided, a heavy silence settled over the battlefields of Ire. Due to Tastar's noble sacrifice, the Overmind was now dead and the Zerg swarms were scattered and broken. As the heroes surveyed their once glorious homelands, you can see Rainer comes from Ire. Did you know that? They realized the victory had cost them all but their lives. Ire was left nothing more than a small and ruin. Those few pros who survived the final battle could only wonder what the future holds for their race. Dang, man. That's bleak. And on a far away on the distant planet Char, Kerrigan, the self styled Queen of Blades, became the Duke of Griffin. Near their time of ascension was at. at yeah, got it! Ta da! Oh my goodness, look at that. There's a hamster in the wheel. Excuse me, there's a dark Templar in the vent. I pointed this out on my monitor. I'm like, hey guys, look at this. But I was like looking at the web camera. Oh, you can see. So uh, I do a lot of biking, as I said, because you can see the um, the tan on my hand. Like, look at that, just like whoop, ding. And then we have a wash tan over here on this arm. So, um, yeah, that's gonna do it for Starcraft One, guys. Thank you for joining me on this journey. I've had fun doing this. Oh, look at that. There's a hydro skin there too. Um, next up is Brood War. I think Brood War is definitely a step up from Starcraft One. I had more fun than I was expecting to with this StarCraft 1 campaign, but for me, Brew War is where it's at. Brew War campaign is excellent. Uh, I like... The Brew War equivalents, compared to the StarCraft 1 equivalents, I like more than the StarCraft 1 campaign. So for example, let me put this in more digestible terms. I like Episode 5 more than Episode 1. I like Episode 4 more than Episode 3. And I like episode six far more than episode two. Like they're all awesome, they're all great. So I'm excited to do this. Um, my only complaint is that like I don't like going from Protoss campaign to Protoss campaign. Like that's like too much Protoss in a short amount of time. I mean, I guess it's fine though. And the fact that like, I enjoyed this Protoss campaign more than I thought was a pleasant surprise. So that was really neat. Whereas, um, but then we, we hit episode five, and it's like it's. Terrans again. I was like, oh, yes. And then after that, it's like the Zerg campaign, but then Kerrigan's the focus. So it's like, oh, yeah. I guess mild spoilers. So, oh, that's exciting. And then we get all the new units to play with too. We get medics for Terran. Oh, it'll be fun. So, 
in some ways, like, we just, we had to get through this to get through, or to get the Brew War. Um, and, yeah, Brew War is just like, oh, chef's kiss. So, um, I think that's all I really have to say, but I tend to have a habit of talking through the credits, so I guess I'll continue talking because we're already part way through them, so, um, this has already been fun. What was pleasant for me and surprising was like how many people actually started watching the series. Uh, that was unexpected, but thank you all for uh, letting me take you up some of your time. It's um, quite the honor that people would spend time watching my content because for me, like as I've done this, I've really become aware of uh, how many hours I have in a day like time's really precious for me so with that in mind like i'm usually pretty careful how i spend my time so the fact that people take time out of their days and really 24 hours in a day isn't that much the fact that they take time out of their days to like watch the stuff that i put out there as a content creator that's all you can really ask for and that's all i can really ask for um because really like for me when i started doing youtube all i ever really wanted was an audience and i have that now like i i achieve what i set out to do and like yes i have plans like i want to like grow bigger and hopefully somehow turn this into like a you know, full-time job if possible but at the end of the day it's just like it's just nice knowing that i have videos and that people can watch the videos and that's um that's more like also Thanks, no particular order. Sausage McMuffins, Mountain Dew, Steven Spielberg. Look at the. I should have been reading these. Oh my goodness. Insomnia, The Girls of Crazy Horse 2. No pencils are hard on the base making this game. Oh, and these are the Brood War credits. Um, we don't need to stick through that. Cool, so yeah, next up. Brewer, look at that. We have Artanis. Oh yeah, it's definitely a StarCraft 2 model. Stukov. He's saying don't smoke. And we have Kerrigan. So guys, that's gonna be it for me. Thank you all so much for watching, and we'll see you next time. Until then, bye!